Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Raghuveer. In this class, we will do some practice examples on median frequency distribution. In our last class, we clearly discussed about uh, how we calculate the median for given discrete values, frequency distribution, continuous values, frequency distribution. We use the equations which we explained in our last class. The same equations will be used here. Our assumption here is you already watched the previous class. Please watch our previous class and come back here. The link for the playlist is provided in the description below. Coming to today's class, uh, this is our first example in a factory. There are th uh, 3000 employees are there. 5% of the workers uh, work less than 3 hours in, the f in a day. And 580 workers work for 3.01 to 4.50 hours. Means 3.01 minute to 4.50 hours uh, uh, in a day. And 30% of the workers work from 4.51 to 6 hours. 500 workers work from 6.01 to 7.50 hours. Similarly, and rest of the workers above 9.01 hours. This is what the data they have given. And we have to identify the median value. It it's clearly shows that this is a continuous distribution, continuous frequency distribution. So if you place it in the table, table form, working hours, work hours are, sorry, it is our work hours are less than three number of employees, uh, 3.01 to 4.50 number of employees. 4.51 to 6 number of employees so we, we we from the question we got this column and this column and one more important point you have to understand uh, for that uh, in order to understand that important point we have chosen this example less than 3 3.01 to 4.50 this is not continuous there is some gap is there 3 to 3.01 you make it continuous how you make it continuous 3 to 3.01 divided by 2 means average of these two values. If you take the average of these two values, what you will get? 0 0.005. Take that value. So that is what equal boundaries. Make the uh, boundaries equal. How we do that? 3.005. 3.005 to 4.505. 4.505 to 6.005. 6.005 to 7.505. You have to equate that. Then solve it. So these are uh, the number of workers. It's very easy. Now we have to identify the cumulative frequency. Then we will substitute this continuous class in the equation. Uh, median is equal to L plus uh, the equation which we discussed in previous class. That is, we have to substitute in that equation. If you identify the cumulative frequency, 150, 730, 150 plus 580, 730, 730 plus 900, 1630, plus 500, 2130, plus 627, plus 270, 3000. Uh, first, you have to identify the median class how you identify the median class n by 2 n by 2 is equal to 1500 1500 comes to this class this is what we call it as median class from this median class uh, the class that before the median class we call it as c value the frequency cumulative frequency value we call it as c value and the equation is like this median is equal to l plus h by f multiplied by n by 2 minus c n by 2 is the value 5 1500 c value is the frequency cumulative frequency which we got before the median class and L means median class what's the what's the range that is provided here 4.51 to 6.0 so L value is H value is 1.500 F frequency means so this is the median class what's the frequency here 900 that is what we have to take if you substitute l plus h by f all the values are provided if you substitute it 4.505 plus 1.5 by 900 multiplied by 1500 minus 730 you will get this value this is how we calculate the median for continuous distribution now coming to the second example here they have given the table this is the table they have given and given n is equal to 229 means number of employees are given number of uh, employees are given 229 and median value is also given m is uh, 46 in this table these two columns uh, 10 30 x uh, means we have to identify x uh, 65 y we have to identify y 25 18 this is what they have provided we have to identify the x and y values uh. so if you want to calculate the median value we will do the cumulative frequency 
10 plus 30, 40, 40 plus x, 40 plus x, 40 plus x plus 65, 105 plus x plus y, 105 plus x plus y plus 25, 130 plus, this is how we calculate, this equal to total number of employees, total number of frequency, total frequency which is equal to n is equal to 229 148 plus x plus y is equal to 229 x plus y is equal to 81 if you want to calculate the median value median is already given 46 is the median value so median class comes to this one this one is the median class the class that before the median class we call it a c value means cumulative frequency is a c value is cumulative frequency of 40 plus x substitute in the equation m is equal to l plus h by f we know the median class median class if you know the median class means this is the median class 10 is the h value frequency is 65 65 is the frequency value so we know that uh, l, l value 46 is equal to l is 40 plus 10 by 65 into 114.5 n by 2 is 114.5 minus 40 plus x c is 40 plus x if you calculate this uh, x is equal to 35.53 so we are taking x is equal to 36 if you substitute x in the x plus y is equal to 81 y is equal to 81 minus 35.53 y is equal to 45.5 y is equal to 46 this is how we will calculate the x and y values hope you understand the concept of median and these examples if you have any questions regarding the concept please post your questions in the comment section below thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates thank you